I wonder if this is the dungeon that everyone's like, have you been to the cool dungeon yet? This might be cool dungeon. If it's cool dungeon, cool. Ariza's side tomb. Is this cool dungeon? I forget how stupidly tanky those guys are. They also hit like a freaking truck. Goodness. Locked by some contraption. Okay, we need light and light. You didn't even get the item from the thing that the bear cracked? I mean, we'll get it later. It's pot people! Hi, pot people. Oh, exploding pot people. I was wondering why one of them had a red head. I guess the red heads would explode. And... Oh, you just got killed by the pot. Jarberg's finest pot people, at your service. Ooh. You hear that? It's another pot person. All right, where the heck are we? <laughs> we came in from there. So let's go check this real quick. There is a, uh, a drop down. Alexander, no! Hmm. Well. Ensnared at a transporter trap. So where are we now? Oh, it's is it just gonna be a maze? Well, I think we're above where we were previously. So it's just gonna be like a maze of teleporter traps. Oh my god, there's so many uh, bells in the walls and everything. Or urns, bells. <laughs> They're urns. They're urns. I see dead people. How did that miss? I got the range on you, buddy. I got the range. Oh, and good, another forked hatchet. That's nice. These guys are always annoying. Grave glove wart and ghost glove wart. And so it begins. I will never be wary. I was gonna say I heard lightning. So, like, have I ever really used a shield in this playthrough yet? No. However, mother... I was still using L1 like I was going to shield. <laughs> it's like, I'll just hold L1, you'll shield the attack, I'm sure. It's another chest. There's also another chest up there, and a chest here. Hmm. Uh, well, there's nothing we could do down there anyways, and the secret chest wall's probably gonna have something important in it. So let's see where this goes. I'm hoping that this one just goes up there, although that might be the secret wall might lead to that balcony. Oh no, this one just leads here. <laughs> oh, 
All right, Perfumer's Cookbook 3. Iron Jar Aromatic. This is the one that everyone is using in PvP. Order from Chaos. This is the one that everyone is using to be freaking Iron Man. Or rather, the Terminator. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. I can't open this. Oh, mother! Let me leave. Perfumers are perfumes are dope. Farming the Miranda powder blows though. Well, that's the one you get from the. Uh, yeah, that's the one you get from the uh, big old flowers, isn't it? All right. Ah, makes sense. Be wary of trap! Oh no, it's a trap! Ooh, ooh. Guys, I think it's a trap. Look, I'm not gonna let you live. If you think I'm gonna let you live, boy, you've got another thing coming. Do the wait? Do the enemies respawn when you use a a teleporter? This one goes back from the ledge. Hold on, that makes no sense. Let me see. So you go you go in here. And this enemy is alive. So this is this is a different area. Because we just killed this enemy and there was a uh you oh, mother fricker. There was a one of those imps that was dead, and then you, when you jump down, there's a, one of those imps that's alive. So there's actually like, it's a trick, isn't it? So if you go down here, this is this is a side. So this leads to the room with the pot guy in it. So we need to go to B side. B side. I'm assuming there's only two sides, but I I could be wrong here. But if we okay, so if we go into the chest. This will be B side. So then if we go down and here, this is a different chest. Look at this. You're on fire, I guess is the reason why you were exploding. We get a crack pot. They do do a lot of damage, admittedly. And then this probably just sends you back. But then, hey look, there's a ladder. Which didn't exist in the other side. Very interesting. So it's not only teleportation puzzle, it's a teleportation and mirrored puzzle. Very cool, I like it. I, I was actually, I was a little bit let down by it just being teleportation chest, so the fact that there's another layer on top of it, I think, is a, is really fun. Oh, the lag. So, wait, hold on. This is, um... I guess I don't know whether this is side A or side B.
Wait, this is... Is this B-side? No, this is A-side because we, we, we broke those pots when we went in here. So we need to... We need to go down. <laughs> down again. We've been through here. I guess we killed the lightning guy from our side. Um, so we need to go... No, we need to go down here. Put on some armor. <laughs> Burke says at least this dungeon is slightly clearer than another one. Hmm. Can't wait. Golden Rune 7. Now before I fight this, uh, we should fight this guy because we're going to go out through the door in a second. But this is, this is B-side. What a, what a, what a champ. Look at him go. Yeah, so this side doesn't actually have the uh, the switch on it. It just had an imp. So what else is here? I wish you wouldn't. Just more glove ward. I don't really care about glove ward, let's be honest. But I'll take it. And then up here is another chest. Oh, it's actually not a chest, but it is an item. Ah! What the frick? <laughs> oh, I didn't see the guy behind me. A ritual pot. I like it. Now. Still like one more thing to do, which is to go kill the last lightning bolt guy. And then I think there's still something else to do. So you're now dead. We've been through both sides of that. Then we need to... Go in this chest no no we've already been through there need to go through this chest and then no we I mean we've already been through this area this just leads you up to the uh, the switch which which we've already hit I think was there a ladder here last time? <laughs> there must have been, right? Oh god, I got no freaking idea. It's a little confusing. The heck? First off, I did it. Have I been through this chest yet? No, I haven't. Have I? Where am I? Oh, I'm at the I'm at the freaking beginning. Unless this is the other side of the beginning. Oh goodness. It's the other side of the beginning. We got another ritual pot. Sorry, dude. I think stone five. Then... Well, we don't need to jump down because we've already been through both of these sides, but we still need to get the hell out of here. Which is through this direction. 
No, I'm on the wrong side. <laughs> uh, I'm lost. I gotta admit though, this is a this is a fun dungeon. I like dungeon like a dungeon like this. It's very um very unique. It's got its own kind of little puzzle going on here. And I did just accidentally stumble across a solution for it, but they they kind of gave you a hint, didn't they? They kind of gave you a hint. Or rather, I stumbled across a hint, I suppose. That there was a uh, an imp that looked like he respawned, but didn't. So we need to go... To go down and over. Fredakta says there's a few of these and it's fun every time. I mean, honestly, that sounds dope. I could see you getting lost here, though, and that's a lot of fun. Felt like I was going insane. <laughs> Dude, can't wait. So that just drops you down, then we go up. Hello, Mr. Hatman. And, oh, there it is right there, okay. Who's the boss? What enemy that we've already found are we gonna get a duplicate of? Grave Warden Duelist and Pot People! Ooh. It's like... It's like that's his summons. His summons are pots. Wish I'd had killed. No! Oh god! He should have killed me, let's be honest. I mean, I'd rather you didn't. Don't even think about it, Grave Warden Duelist. I use rainbow stones for uh, waypointing. That's actually a pretty good idea. Having the uh, like stones on the ground to be used for uh, orienting yourself. I could see it. Oh, you exploded. Soul, soul jars of fortune ashes. Let's go. He's got jar, boys. No precious item ahead? Their precious item was the jar boys. That was a fun little dungeon. I don't think there was another um another boss though, because it there was a dead end inside the tomb. So I think we've basically done it. Now, you know what would be kind of hilarious is that if you did all of this. You were still on the wrong side when you left the dungeon, and then you just got to like another version of the whole world. <laughs> that would now that would be truly mind blowing, but also kind of fun. Now you can have Jar Boys too. I can't have Jar. Oh, I can't have Jar Boys, but save that for another day. <laughs> <laughs> 